And then, uh, yeah, if you're the 95th texter, you're going to the movies on us. In the meantime, wait for Shania, your superstar of the day, is on the way in minutes. Stay close. I am insensitive. I have a tendency to pay more attention to the things that I need. Sometimes I drink too much. Sometimes I test your trust. Sometimes I don't know why you stay. Got a original 1959 Cadillac AM Wonder Bar. Uh, this radio was in great shape inside and out. Uh, we didn't have to mess with the case at all. We left it natural, just like it was. We done a polishing job on all the chrome. Went through it and we done a full conversion on it from a raw design. It has AM FM stereo, four channels out, 45 watts a channel. You can run one speaker up to four. It automatically runs the diagnostics on itself. Every time you turn that radio on, it knows how many speakers it's running. Uh, it has uh, free outs on it. If you want to add a sub or an amp to your speakers. Uh, it's, it's got auxiliary in. It is uh, automatic auxiliary in. It's sitting there listening for a device to come into it. It has USB port, charge your phone, and play your MP3, MP4 files on a thumb drive. This is the harness you'll be getting. Uh, you can use the bracket or take it out of that, and you'll be getting a thumb drive with some music on it. It also is a Wonder Bar, so the Wonder Bar still works like it always did. And it is foot switch controlled. It has a foot switch on it. Your foot switch, it also is a push button. You can work your uh, your Bluetooth and voice command and USB with the Wonder Bar, the foot control, and the push button. It's all set up to do that. Uh, let me find a little station there with some music on it so we can demonstrate the balance. It has a built-in fader. There's your front speakers and your rears. It also has a balance built into the treble and bass control. Uh, you're going to go counterclockwise twice on it. One, two. It's going to beep and after that you're going to go, when you quit beeping you're going to be in the balance mode. Uh, you can go from right to left until you find what you want as long as you're moving that pot. And when you find what you want just stop. It'll beep once and then go back to treble and bass. There's your right speakers. Right speakers, left speakers. Balance it out, just let it beat once. Back on treble and bass. Your sensitivity button still works. You can get more stations by moving it all the way over. Uh, back it up. That'll break it up into different stations. First thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to demonstrate the auxiliary in. We're going to put a little iPod on it. You'll get a male to male cord. And all you do is plug it in. And as soon as you turn it on, the radio's sitting there listening for the it's going to switch straight to it. 
place and in love too. That's how your auxiliary end works. You can do uh, CD players, uh, satellite radio, plug your phone into it and everything. When you're done with it, just turn the device off. And in 20 seconds, it'll cycle right back around to where you had the radio. If you don't want to wait 20 seconds, see the green lights lit up, just simply turn it off. And right back on, take you right back to where you had it in that shutdown mode. If I turn it off now and went back, I'm going to go to AM radio. There's your AM radio. Turn it off and back on right back to stereo. Next thing we're going to do, it has Bluetooth, voice command, and voice assist. We're going to run it in. Let me bring my phone up and make sure what I've got on Bluetooth so far. I've got several, so I'm going to get rid of them. They picked up on one right then. Now she should say it's disconnected. That's a voice. That's your voice to see us. Uh, we're going to use the push button here to, to actually pair up, show you how that goes. You just push it in and hold it. Ready to pair. It's going to show up on your phone. Just tap on it. And when it's done, she'll tell you that it's paired up. Pairing completed. Device connected. Alright, we're paired up. We're ready to go. We're going to do a voice command. This is your mic up here. you got plenty of extension. You can put it up on mine's on the side visor. You can hide it wherever you want to. We're going to do the same method by holding this down. Play music. That's going to open up my music on my phone. change my songs, I got three ways to do it. I can use the push button. That'll change the songs. Twice, we'll back up and repeat. I can use the wonder bar. Or I can use the foot switch. So you're capable of changing songs and answering phone calls with all three devices. Phone call comes in, the music go away, you hear it ringing, push your wonder bar or the button or step on the foot switch, answer your call and talk. When you want to end the call, just press the button twice, that'll end the call for you. That's how your voice command works. We're going to bring it up and tell it to quit. You don't have to use voice command. You can turn your phone off and it'll go right back to radio. Stop music. Gonna put it in pause. Now turn my phone off so it recognizes my phone again. Now it's gonna cycle right back around to radio. Because I turned the phone off. <clears throat> That's how your everything works on it. I'm gonna do a little balance here. I don't have it quite right where I want it. There we go. I'm sitting on the wrong side of the room to be running balance on the radio. Uh, it's also, these radios back in, uh, have it so you can uh, push or pull and raise and lower your antenna. So we've got that wired up so it'll work. Push it in, raise it up, pull it out. I, my knob's not locked on there, so I have to push it from the back side. 
but if you pull it out, that will lower your antenna, whichever way they want to wire it up. We got that wired up with a fuse on it. That's ready to go. Back on radio now. I really like the Wonder Bars when they work good. Alright, now we're going to do the USB. Uh, you'll get a thumb drive with some music on it. That way the file's on it. And you can put your music in the file, whatever you want to do. MP3, MP4, it'll play it all. Uh, we're going to push it in. As soon as we do, it's going to go to the USB drive. Now we're on USB. Same song, push the push button. Same thing we did with the phone. I'm gonna change it here, you can just push, push, put switch. Or the Wonder Bar. I'm gonna back up and repeat. Hit that one twice and back up. Now you don't have to take your thumb drive out to cut it off and go back to radio. The only time you should have to take that out, because I've lost them, who had not uh, You can leave it in there if you hide this or whatever, and all you gotta do is hold this down for one second, and it'll cycle back around and go back to radio. One second. This is gonna blink, and that little light in the center, and now we're gonna go back to radio. Back on stereo, uh, same thing going down the road, if you want to bring your thumb drive up and start playing it, just push it down for one second. Right back to the thumb drive where we left it. I know I'll put some country on there. Somewhere. There we go. Change your songs on that. You can uh, go forward with that. Go forward with the foot switch, go forward with the button, or if you want to back up, twice on the button. That's how your USB works, let's hold it down one second, let's go right back to radio. Uh, once you do this a, a week or so, playing with it, uh, It'll, it'll be like, it'll come right to you. Main thing is get your speakers and all set up the way you like it. And then you don't have to fool with all this back here. All you got to worry about is the button, the foot switch, and the Wonder Bar. That's your original 1959 Cadillac. Uh, it's ready to go. Everything's wired up and done. And I appreciate you letting me do it for you. Have any questions, just call me. Thank you.